Welcome to Big Bear Trailers in Houndall, Northamptonshire. Today we've got a review for you on the Debon C700. I'm just going to go come out of shot for a second just to give you some details. So this is currently the largest in the Debon box trailer range. Has a 2600 gross weight, which means it's got a load carrying capacity of just over 1900 kilograms. Internally, once we open it up, the rectangular floor space is 335 centimeters long. 166 wide and that's where it differentiates from its smaller c500 xl uh, version in that this is wider same length but just wider the other big consideration on this one and we'll see it when we close in on the wrap is the ramp on this trailer has a thousand kilogram load carrying capacity whereas all the smaller ones are about five to six hundred kg um, so let me come back into shot for you one of the things i just wanted to show was the sidewalls on this trailer are the double skin aluminium planking. So as you can see, two skins with a cavity in the middle. We quite often do the cargo rail fittings. So we'd fit those to the inside, do a fixing top and bottom, every other one all the way along. And what we're doing is piercing the inner skin, going into the cavity, but leaving the outer skin completely intact. Really quite handy from a flexibility. You can also lock shoring poles into these as well so have a nice strong structural bar going left to right but let's show you the trailer first things first as you can see yeah it does have some more reinforcement on the back which is why it's got the thousand kilogram load this opens as a ramp or a barn door the right hand latch is drilled out ready to take a padlock and the factory do give you a small padlock you can bolster the security by going for an extra lock around the outside but there's also some internal options we can look at for you as well. So if I just open this up, undo both latches, and then we can just pull down. It is supported by two struts, so you do have to sort of pull against it. Hitch neutral about there, and then just push down nice and gently. It's got a really nice grippy aluminium floor, so lots of traction for going up and down. And then the upper flap opens up first. So I'm six foot six tall, so I can stand up inside this one really nice and easy obviously aluminium planking you do on this model have four tie points evenly spread down the sidewall there and as you can see from them each tie point is rated to 250 kg um, spare wheel comes to us loose but typically we would mount it there i'm just going to come out because i'm a bit echoey in there um, you can see the spare wheel we tend to mount there um, we can not fit it we can now set it to one side or the other we tend to put it there so it acts as a nice little bump stop just in case it is accessible but it's not taking any of the rectangular floor space you probably can't see it but there is a little internal light just up here so if you are attached to a tow vehicle with the tow vehicle's lights on you can switch that internal light on and off if we close it up to so bring that down first the ramp closes up against it but i'm just going to show you the barn door as well so pretty much from the closed position come back over here open that one up again and then just open the pin down here and now that will open up as a barn door so there you, there you go you can see that's open that way and nice and easy again close that back up again just gonna need to lift a little bit there we go and pop that pin back in again it's now ready again to open up as a ramp if i walk you down this side of the trailer so on each side you've got one wheel chock so if you are storing the trailer on level ground and parking up you can use a wheel chock instead of leaving the handbrake on as we come down here you've got a personnel door on the aluminium sided trailer we tend to always order them on the passenger door on the uk passenger side we can order them on the other side or we have done a few for customers where they want a door on both sides so that is an optional extra we can look at um, it is lockable to both top and bottom to open up push in at the top rotate forward do the same there and it has got a little sucker pad to hold that open so we can just pull that open and hold that back so really handy for just checking on the loads if you're on the way somewhere but you just want to check everything's nice and stable rather than opening everything up in the back and showing the world what you've got going on you can just see what's in there and then finally i just wanted to a couple of things actually suspension on these trailers the suspension on this trailer is a coil spring with a shock absorber so pretty much car-like suspension 
What you're seeing is the ride handling of these is just brilliant. They are so grippy. A lot of box trailers are quite bouncy and skippy when they're on either no load or light load. These don't, they just hunker down and travel really well. They're just a pleasure to tow, particularly if you've got a nice tow vehicle. The other advantage is because of the suspension, you see the ride height is really quite low, so it gives you a nice shallow ramp angle as well. So it just makes it really nice and easy to use. We do lots of these trailers for businesses. So if you look at it, it's great to have as a showcase for your business, but with the tie down points on the inside, with the features it's got, and maybe with some cargo rails as well, it just makes it a really usable trailer. So you've got the best of both worlds, a showcase, but also a really practical trailer too. Just wanted to also show you the auto jockey wheel. So if you're used to trailers, you're probably used to winding up and then releasing the clamp, lifting the clamp up, clamping it off again. With this one, you just wind once you're hitched, just keep winding again. And what happens is this pin comes up, eventually it will hit this collar and the wheel just folds up against that. So that's an auto lift jockey wheel. Really nice and easy. And you've got the pull handle there as well. So hopefully that helps. Um, if you've got any questions or queries, please feel free to give us a call or take a look at our website. Our website is bigbeartrailers.co.uk. Our telephone number 01832 eight. If we can help at all, please do give us a call. The only bit I haven't colored, covered is colors. Um, obviously aluminum side, so it always looks that sort of silver color on the side. This one's in black, which tends to be for this model our favorite color, but we can also do white, light gray, dark gray, black, burgundy. Um, but I say black and dark gray tends to be our customers' favorites. But if we can help at all, please do give us a call. My name's Ian, but the team here are also happy to help you. As I say, 01832 770 treble 8. Thanks for your time. Bye now.